Hi everyone, it's Arlene. Thank you for joining me for my Sunday Scrapbook Share video. I know that I haven't exactly come out with this video every Sunday, um, but I do try my best. Again, I do have other priorities and obligations over creating videos on YouTube. I do have a family and work and, and other things, so I really appreciate those who understand that. Um, and also, I just wanted to start off by saying I know a lot of you message me um, through YouTube and also through my email address and I just want you not to take it personally if I don't respond or don't respond right away. Um, as I just mentioned, I do have you know other obligations and those of you who are mothers and work full-time understand that. So please don't take my non-response personally. Um, I do try to get to as many messages as I can, but then again, um, like I said, I do have other priorities over YouTube and um, I appreciate you understanding that. And before I started, um, I actually have just a few things that I wanted to share with you guys. Um, I did get my pages from Bona, and this is for the Graphic 45 Halloween in Wonderland mini album page swap that she hosted for the month of August, and I wanted to go ahead and share those pages with you guys. Um, but before I do that, um, you know, many of you have already seen the video that Bona put out, and I just want to say that please, 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 please respect her privacy. And, um, you know, and, and she did put that video out to let you guys know that she does care and, um, and that she is very thankful for each and every one of you. So for those of you who have sent me messages, um, please understand if I don't respond. And I do appreciate that you respect her privacy. So with that said, I want to go ahead and share these pages with you guys because they all came out awesome. And um, I was in the Baroque group, and this is the group that got the Baroque die as their mini album page and we had to create a mini album page um, from length side um, top to bottom with the binding on this side here so we had to leave enough space so this is um, this is the first page that I got it's really awesome it's actually going to be the cover of my album I haven't bound it yet because I haven't figured out how I want to do it because all of the pages are pretty bulky and um, it, it, it just it's very difficult to bind so I don't know what I'm going to use yet to bind it but there's a little um, bottle here that says drink me it's really cute and then there's some fringe here and Halloween Wonderland um, and this is actually created by Crystal Booth um, sorry for the I don't know if it's clear or not guys you know, I'm using a different camera so I'm sorry if it's blurry I'm not even looking at the camera to see if you guys can see what I'm doing um, I wonder if I can autofocus Okay, well anyways guys, so, um, and then she has a little picket fence, and many of you have seen Bona's videos, so I'm not going to go in too much detail with the pages, but they're just all gorgeous, and I wanted to share them with you. Um, this one has a little keyhole that flips up, which is really cool, and it's the Tim Holtz um, Ornate Frames, I think it's the name, and she threw in like this little frame that we can incorporate into the mini album later. I'm sorry for the blurriness, guys, this is like, um... I'm on my um, SLR camera because I can't find my digital camera from the weekend because we had a party for my son. But this page is by Lori R. And she's um, Clippin' Girl on YouTube. But very pretty page. And then this page right here is by Lily Marquez and she's Ten Angel Kisses on YouTube. And really cute. I love the little teapot and she made a little clock here and used some Webster's Pages trim. And then this is really neat here. I love how she did this little hat that comes out and then there's, um, oops. There's like a page for journaling on there. So really neat, and it's a top hat. Very cute, I love that. Saw her video on that, and I was really impressed by that. This is Bona's page, it's really cute. She has like the little rabbit. I love how she did the scroll here, if you guys can see that. And then she's got the dry embossing, and then the um, spider web. And then she's got the rabbit. And then really pretty glimmer mist. I like the colors that she used. And it says, don't believe in reality. Really cute. That's the front page and here's the back page she has a couple of tickets here one with her info and another one for journaling and really pretty um, lace and beads and she's got a little teapot charm really cute and this one here is by sorry guys my kids are loud um, this is Laura Contessa Creations and oh, I guess I'll start on this page so she has those two tags she's got the spider web that's really cool how she used that to hold the tags in and then she's got some really cool spider web sheer trim and then some flowers. And then on this side, this is neat how she made the pocket watch. I like that. And I love this little thing that she used up here. I'm not sure what it is, but it might be like a jewelry piece, but it really does look like a 
a pocket watch. It's really neat. And then she has this little tag here, a little guy, and she's got a pumpkin. Super cute, love it. And then this one here, um, this is by Mary Ellen, Allen, sorry. And she's bags buttons on bag buttons on YouTube, and she's got this really pretty frame that she put the tag in, and then a whole bunch of um, looks like Prima flowers and the stick pin and some feathers. And then on this side she has her tag, opens up like that. And I love that those stamps that she used for the journaling. It's really pretty, and she used the Tim Holtz fragment and glued it on there. If you guys can see that again, sorry for for the blurriness. I have to keep this at a distance. Like, there you go. Now it's clear. <laughs> I really got to find my digi camera. And this one here is by Emily Martina, and she's Bean Scraps and Sheep. And she included a little tea bag. It's cute. It says, Drink Me. A really pretty flower, and on a Tim Holtz memo pen, some feathers. And then on this side, she has her pocket with a tag. Super cute. So I'm so excited to get this together because um, I haven't completed a Halloween mini album yet. And then this is my page, really simple. You guys have seen my video on it. Um, it's got like the little, and Bonus showed it on one of her videos. It's got the fringe down here, and then this opens up. Um, okay, I'll show you guys just really quick. Um, and like I said, I haven't gotten much scrapping done lately. Um, it's just been crazy. I just have a lot of family obligations, guys. So appreciate you understanding that there aren't, there probably isn't going to be any crafting videos out in a little bit. So there we go, and then some journaling in the back. So that's Velcro that I used, by the way, to adhere that on. Okay, and then that ties shut. And this tag goes back in there. Okay, and then um, when Bona mailed that to me, she actually sent me some other things that people had sent me, and I haven't opened them yet, so I got a new moon tag from somebody. See, I haven't opened any of this yet, like I said, so I'm excited to find out who this is by. Um, it says Team, and then Edward over here. Oh my god, he's just, he's just so hot. And this is by... Um, I'm sure that says Taffy, I'm not sure. But thank you so much. I really appreciate it. Okay, please message me and let me know. I'm not, I don't know if I'm reading this right. But look at how cool that is. I love that she made this into a file folder with more pictures. That is so awesome and I love the distress work that she did. So thank you so much for sending me this. I really appreciate it. I could add that with all of my um, Twilight stuff. And then this is, this was sent to me too. Oh gosh, with this SLR camera, it doesn't even tell me like how far in I am on the video. Hope it doesn't stop on me. Um, there's a card in here, so I'm gonna go for the card first. Oh wow, what a gorgeous card. Look at that butterfly, you guys. Um, it says, here's the postcards from Paris tags that I got sent back inadvertently. I also included some extra goodies and a page for your Wonderland album, Something to Brighten Your Day, Hugs Kathy. So this is Kathy, and she's Canadian Scrapper Girl. Kathy, thank you so much. Oh my gosh. So she participated in, um, in, one, of my tag, in one of my tag swaps. Yeah, the Paris tag swap, the uh, postcards from Paris. And I had inadvertently sent her back another tag when she had told me to go ahead and keep it so that I could um, have it. So thank you so much, Kathy, for sending it to me. And here, let me share that one with you guys first so you know what I'm talking about. Her tag was gorgeous. And she has a video out on how she created it. And it's kind of funny. It was like kind of drama city for her. <laughs> She's so funny. She cracks me up. So this is her Paris tag. Thank you so much, Kathy. I really appreciate it. I'm so glad to have one. So I'm going to keep that with all of my, my gorgeous tags from all of you ladies. So thank you so, so much. And um, if you guys can even see that. See, it's not focusing. Kathy's Canadian Scrapper Girl, all one word, um, on YouTube. So, oh wow, look at she sent me some, some charms. Ooh, look at the little car. That one's cute. Again, I can't, uh, it's getting blurry when I pull it up close, guys. I'm so sorry about that. And then she sent me some really pretty Prima Lace and a stick pin. Her stick pins are gorgeous, guys, so check out her channel. Here's a stick pin. She's so pretty. Oh, she even capped it off so I don't poke myself. That is way cool. Thank you so much, Kathy. That's gorgeous. Love her beading. Thank you so much. And then she sent me a ton of butterflies. 
Thank you so much, Kathy. You're so sweet. And these are die cuts. Gorgeous. Thank you so much. Those are so pretty. I love those. And then she, um, oh, she sent me one of her, um, her pages. Cute. It's a Baroque also. Thank you so much. Oh my gosh, I'm totally adding this to the rest of my mini albums pages for bonus thing. How pretty is that? I love that she, um, she used the Alice, um, image in the background there, but look how gorgeous that is. It's got, like, lots of pockets and lots of space for pictures. Thank you so much, Kathy. You're so sweet. I really appreciate you thinking of me and sending me one of these. I really love it. Okay, and then um, she sent me a whole bunch of other little things here. Let me just make sure I'm not missing anything. Okay. So she sent me some orange flowers. Ooh, I like that skull. Can you guys see the skull there? That is cool. Thank you so much, Kathy. And there's like a little spider in here. Thank you so much. It's going to help with all of my um, Halloween stuff that I so need to work on. Look at the beautiful fibers. Perfect. They go perfectly with the um, Halloween and Wonderland collection. You can see that? It's so pretty. So thank you so much, Kathy. Oh, and then she sent me some tags. I missed, almost missed this. Way cool. I don't have any of these stamps, too. Ooh, I love that one. Okay, so thank you, Kathy. Thanks again, guys, for watching, and hope you have a great week. Talk to you later. Bye.